Welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming, where we are the voices inside your head. I'm Jonas. And I'm TNT. And I'm IT Explosive One, and we are playing Who Wants to Be a Mew, you know. Dude, I'm closer than ever. All right, dude, we got to do good this episode because there's less millionaire this week, so we have to do good, all right? Don't suck. <laughs> I will try my hardest not to suck. All right, we got freaking Wink here. He's going to give us some questions. What is singing without an instrument called? I know this. It's Alcapoco. Alcupelu, Acapelli, or Acapella. Which one is it, Jonas? Uh, it is Acapella I'm with an A. And so I'm choosing D. It's D, Acapella. You freaking jerk. Yes, that's my final answer. Oh, she has a British accent. I forgot. Oh, Boom. that's right. Acapella, easy. Who steals from the rich and gives to the poor? Is it Robin, Robin Field, Field, Robin Town, Robin, Robin Good, Hood, or Robin? We had this question before. We 100%. Yeah, you know what game we don't get repeats on? Because I said Robin on? Givens. What's that? We don't get repeats on Wheel of Fortune. <laughs> we don't. We no. Don't, we don't get those on Wheel of Fortune. Uh, which animal is a man's best friend? The duck, the hamster, the dog, or the cat? God, my I'm lifelong friend, the hamster. <laughs> Came in my pocket. God knows that my pet duck is goes everywhere I go, too. You know? <laughs> my duck, my duck, my duck, my duck. I don't even know what that is. No, is that my brother, kid my buddy. sister? Which artist released the album Thriller? George Michael, Britney Spears, is Eminem, or Michael Jackson? Ah. Oh, it's a trick question, it Jonas. Was. It's None of those other people were alive then. No. <laughs> they, I mean, they all were. Yes, I'm pretty sure they were children. And George Michael was an adult. Oh, yeah. He was sure. whamming it up, dude. He was waking you up before you go. <laughs> Wake me up before you go, go. Which animal was often described as a chicken thief, a dog, a fox, a sheep? Or a cat. I guess a fox, right? Yeah, I think it's fox. That's a, that's sure that's kind of it's a. It's like uh, an old racist cartoon sure? meme. What? <laughs> Why is it racist? Because all those old fox. cartoons had racist undertones, man. But a fox stealing chickens ain't racist. I don't know, dude. It probably had some racism in the cartoon. Look at though. you trying to add drama to the question, Jones. I like that. <laughs> that's what I like it do, that. bro. It's racist because they like foxes and Asian people, right? Wow. <laughs> I did not say that, but yeah, I get what you're saying. A new question for you. <laughs> you know, all right, which of these robots does not appear in the Star Wars movies? R2-D2, BB-8, T-1000, or C-3PO? Jesus. Okay, that's not hard. It's not? T-1000. Yeah, Let's no. go with the right answer. And I do like that they went with all numbers, though. Yeah. So this is your plan. I don't. I'm not too familiar with BB-8, but I know he is adorable. He was in the newest one. He's the one that rolls around, right? Yeah, he's like just two balls. I hope you ever <laughs> from the pun intended. Is your new question. <laughs> Where's the pun at there? There's not one. <laughs> it's just a ball joke. Ah, to which, go. <clears throat> which is the infinitive form of the verb in the following sentence? She goes home at the end of the day. To go. It is to go. I have learned that infinitive form is just like the Spanish form of every verb. <laughs> we have learned that. Hablar is the infinitive form. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We've played enough of these where we know what the infinitive form of, yep, of this is. This game is. has taught me that, for sure. There you go, learned. Yeah, dude. I should have learned that in high school, but... <laughs> what is the nationality oh, of the stinger Adele? Is she French, American, English... Or Japanese. Wait a minute. I'm English. Hmm. What's the difference between American and English? I'm English people are from England. Okay. American people see. are from America. You know yeah. what my next Fair enough. Is, right? I'll take it. I'll take it. Final answer? I'll take it. Yes. I know she's what? English, though. I love Adele, oh, by the way. Do you really? I absolutely I love Adele. I had both of her albums. Oh, yeah? Or all three of her albums. Are you t kidding me? He won't go. Maybe it's someone else. All right. Uh, with, with, with whom did Justin Timberlake write a, the song The Other Side for the movie Trolls 2 World Tour? With whom? 
Take your time. Um. All right. Who do you think it is? No, nope, hmm. no, nope, no answer, huh? Fine. Hmm. I think that it's Pharrell Williams, um, because oh, I, I, dude, I really have no idea, but probably fair. Yeah, I would think. I so. feel like it's Pharrell because Pharrell was doing, but he did like minion stuff. But I don't think it was SZA. I don't think I don't think Lizzo or I don't think it was. Lizzo. I mean, I mean, it probably is Rob Knox or something stupid. I, I think we should ask the audience. I think the audience would know. Because I'm not 100% sure. First first idea is Pharrell Williams, because I know he's been doing a lot of children's movies. He did that uh, that happy song for the Minions movie. Yeah, it is happy. Oh. Oh, wow. It's the two that they think it is are the ones that we were like, nah. So it might be SZA, dude. The RZA, the Jizza, the ghost face killer. All right. I guess we're going to... I say we go in with the audience pick. I don't care. <laughs> Well, there you go. Jonas doesn't give a <laughs> shit. All right, so I guess we're going to the. He would have won the. He would have won the Senate race with fifty well, percent of the vote. I don't even know what that means. Who Rob Knox? You know. gotta have fifty percent, dude. Who the hell is Rob Knox? I don't know any. I have no clue. It was SZA. All right, dude. The U, the U.S. audience knew something. Holy crap! It was actually SZA. I, I, I did don't even not know who think... SZA is. She's a female uh, Oh, it's a woman? Yeah. Female oh. vocalist. I was thinking Rizza and Jizza, they're men. She has a pretty good song called The Weeknd, where she talks about how she's the weekend girl and she doesn't appreciate it. Oh, uh, really because he, he has a wife during the week. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Where do domestic pigeons live? I think this in is a, a trick question. In a kennel, in a cage, in an aviary. I think they live in an aviary. No, because you don't keep a pigeon in like a little bird cage. You would keep them in a pigeon pen, right? A, a pigeon, pigeon pen, a pigeon coop, a pigeon pen. Because a cage is too small. A kennel, I don't think, is the right nomenclature. An aviary is like a little bird room. An aviary is like a bird sanctuary. I don't know, dude. It's like a big. One. Let's. Uh, what what number are we on? What what uh? We're pretty far up. The we're halfway there, my bro. Right. I will. So these, let's actually, fifty fifty it. 50 50 phone a friend or i don't want to switch the question the entirely yet but all right okay. well 50 50 i'm fine with you because if it's like a cage or an aviary then we you know it's they don't keep them in a cage i feel like it's pen it was not pen cage is too small for a bird i think all right we'll go with aviary yeah i think, dude, yeah. I think we'll go with aviary but I, I don't you know like the little like room i think the kate the big rooms they have on the top of a yeah but who who has room for that for a domestic who pigeon? has a pigeon in their house bro i mean nobody <laughs> it is an aviary all right fair enough dude fair enough when i think aviary i just think of like large scale but, but yeah like a like a uh, like the zoo yeah. Yeah, I feel you. So when I think like a domestic pigeon, I'm like a pet pigeon would just live in a pen. You just put in one <laughs> just pigeon one pigeon. Pen. Where would a pet pigeon live? You know, domestic Yeah, pigeon. that's fair. Which, oh, you know this. Which of these games was not created by Blizzard Entertainment? Overwatch, hey, Diablo, Diablo hey, hey, Warcraft, Warcraft, hey, hey. hey. Counter Strike, right, obviously. I knew that. <laughs> Damn, I'm not even a Blizzard fanboy and I knew that. <laughs> yeah. They definitely didn't do CS:GO, so let's let's f and go. How about that? Those other three games are like some of the best games ever made. Oh man, Overwatch, dude! I play that game to this day. Over eight hundred hours on Wrecking Ball. Don't at me. <laughs> they want you to come on their tournament team. No, they don't because I'm still trash. Okay, let's take a breather. You're up there. Eh, I can beat most people in quick play. That's good, but there's also like children. <laughs> yeah, that's very true. I there can be grade schoolers. There are also like children. <laughs> Where do lemurs come from? Oh, like a specific place? Dude, yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah, who knows? And It ain't in the U.S. It ain't Russia. It's either Reunion Island or Madagascar. Yeah, I can tell you that much, um, but who freaking knows? Let's just swap the question. We're high enough up, I think. <sighs> Phone a friend is jank as F, dude. Which is all the more reason we should use it. All right, fine. Get it out of here, dude. If it's not going to work, it's not going to work. We got to see how certain they are. Oh, well, 100%. Let's call the oldest person. <laughs> well, we're obviously going to call a male because, you know. Mm. No, they're all women. Pierre? <laughs> Andy. Who do you think we should call? Should we hey, call Vanessa? Andy? Should we call Andy or... Ava or Pierre. Everyone but the person I said. Anyone. 
Did you said Vanessa? Aunt Vanessa, dude. You want to call Vanessa? Yes. You think Aunt v- freaking Vanessa knows where the lemurs do. came from? I- <laughs> when have you ever met anybody named Vanessa that knew anything? Never. I've never met anyone named Vanessa. I've known Vanessas, and they don't know sh- nothing. <laughs> they don't know anything. Eva? Do you know something? Ava's a colleague. I think either Andy or Pierre would probably. Let's call Pierre know. then, dude. He sounds like he knows animals. Our cousin Pierre. All right, let's call Pierre. It's Vanessa's kid. Oh God, and he's stupid too. Pierre, this is who wants to be a millionaire. <laughs> no offense, party. Vanessa. How are you? <laughs> After you just good. called her I'm, stupid. I'm stressed out nonetheless because oh, I want to answer the question correctly. Actually, Julie oh, no. needs you for that. He's We're on drugs. In you. Yes. Think carefully. Clearly. And answer quickly. I have no idea about that, but B, maybe, maybe. I, I don't know. I'm, I'm really sorry. Oh, God, dude. Why did you pick Vanessa's kid? I told you he was stupid. What do you think, Jonas? I think it's I, B, too. I think we should use swap a question. All right, fine. We'll swap the question out, dude. Get it out of here. You choose to play it was B, though. Using your switch. I feel like it had to be B. Because they're common. I've never even heard of reunion. It was freaking B. I knew it. Yeah, dude. dude that's uh, the ones that we always miss or the ones we've never heard of one of the answers. Like Rob Knox. The game I've never, yeah. Start, but you shouldn't stop there. Who wrote Here The Old Man in the Sea? Mm. Jonas? I think it's Hemingway. Well, it ain't J.K. Rowling. I'll tell you that much. Please. And I don't. It's definitely not Jane Austen. She wrote Great Expectations. Yeah. yeah. No, it's not did, John. She did Stein. not write Great Expectations. Charles Dickens wrote that. Steinbeck wrote Of Mice and Men and Great... Then uh, what did Jane Austen write? She wrote, like, uh, Pride and Prejudice. Pride and Prejudice. Yeah. I don't know how I know that. I think it is Hemingway. But All right. I think it is, too. I'll go with Hemingway on this one. I'm pretty I'm pretty confident in that, that show. Because I know it's not the other ones. That's my final answer. Yeah. It is. Boom, baby. We about to get this million. We're at 125k, big boy, baby, bigs, big baby boy with the big boy, baby, big baby boy with the baby boy, big boy brain. Ooh, I love alliteration, even when it's the same word. Yeah, baby, 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 big baby, big babe. Wah, 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 little baby. <laughs> what is the average distance between the sun and the earth? Oof. It's uh, hold on. Let's what's the they might be giant song. Uh, 93 million. 93 million. Is it 93 million? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. The right sun go. is a mass of incandescent gas. So <laughs> you singing the song? Or I should say, are you just like I'm, I'm going through the mumbling the song? Yeah. Congratulations, Jones. You got it right. The because your might be giant. Uh, the sun is not. Knowledge. Hey, man. I like question? when songs help me Good learn, dude. Like. Now I know my ABCs. All right. What is the name of a sentence containing all 25 letters of the alphabet? I know this. 26. What is it? Did I say plantain. No, dude. It's a parent. It's a pentagram. Yeah. The plantain is a banana. The plantain. (laughs) A gamma. No, a gamma is the case that you put things in and escape from Tarkov so that you don't lose them when you die. Oh. You have made Jeez. Look at us knowing the hot takes, dude. I actually knew that. I knew the 93 million miles. You knew the, the pentagram. What's our last question? Please this be a video game This is the last question. One. We've made it to the last question. Yep. We told You said we had to step our game up. We're only doing one. Oh, my God, Jonas. But we've been doing so poorly over, like, the last few weeks. Yeah, dude. It's like I don't even know what to do. All right. Here we go. Which of these I is know not this. a Netflix original Easy. Umbrella, I don't know. Since 8, I don't know. Breaking Bad. Breaking Bad is not a Netflix original. Jonas. Oh, my God. Jonas. We did it. We freaking did it. We we, freaking did it. We've got a million, like, what, three times out of, like, 25 episodes? We did it. (gasps) Walter White coming through in the end. Big boy, you baby freaking boy. doubted us. You put us down. You wrote in the comments mean and awful things about our intelligence. I'm taking the dunce cap off the thumbnail for this one. Oh, no Jesus. dunce cap. We're no Einstein's cap. today. That is all the time we have for today's episode of Crazy Towns, folks. Please make sure to like and subscribe. If you already did that, hit that notification bell. We'll tell you when we do stuff for Jonas. TNT. We are out. Dee, dee, dee.